amount of like anti-air tools like yes. Nair, uh, Elf Thunder. You know, a lot of things will force Peach to land. Uh, right. So you know, there's a. Uh, it's kind of like a weird. It's like a weird trading system between the two mm -hmm. almost. Yeah, very Fire Emblem, really. Yep, definitely. <laughs> Three, two, one, go! And here we are at Starterville, just getting right into it. Oh, I don't... It's weird to me when there's a Robin within, like, close range of it, of their opponent, but on purpose. Yeah. Oh, nice, Thoron. So wow. we saw Scorpio get a lot of mileage out of Thoron in his match against Yeti. Right. And basically this is what he did that whole game. He stood on the taxi platform, he charged up, and then... In some moments where, you know, maybe you'd be able to block an Arc Thunder or an L Thunder, you just can't do it to a Sauron. Right. Ooh, that was oh, really great smart. Dodge. I really like that. Catches the Levin Sword. Alright, yeah, he's gotta do some work now while that's gone. Yeah, of the four of the four varieties of Thunder, Thoron is oh. the most useful for catching Peach, just because mm -hmm. like if you descend with it too, like the beam descends with Robin's hand. Oh, okay. So it's like a progressively downward moving wall of pain. Yeah, that sounds really tough. Mm -hmm. Trying to get that float catch in the air. Right. Chuck oh wow. Oh he's a little too high DI. percent for it now too, the DI. Just misses the Z drop. Ooh. Oh, yep. oh, wow. Yep. That young. Oh, that. <laughs> oh, takes it bodied right back. and bodied. Scorpio is not about it today. Let's go. Yeah, they're getting in there. Uh, last time we saw Scorpio on Smashville, he didn't lose a stock in a five and a half minute match. Wow. So this is a little faster pace. Right. Definitely. Um. Yeah, like like I said, a lot of uh, the tools at Robin's disposal will force Peach to land or approach on the ground, which her her ground approach isn't bad, but compared to her aerial approach, you can't help but just kind of feel bad about it. Yeah, we saw Dane's mom trying to walk in, try and get uh, a little earlier shield availability, but not enough. Yep, these tomes are just not letting Dane's mom do anything she wants to do right now. Ooh. Yeah, forcing that roll, but unable to punish it. Great. The one thing uh, Peach does have on Robin definitely is that it's really difficult for a Robin to land against a Peach just because Robin doesn't have any effective tools to attack under him. Three steps ahead. Yeah. So it's a little, it's a, it's not a good time for a Robin to try to land against a Peach. Yeah. Do you, but do you think we're gonna see the Rosa here for game two? Uh, I would not be surprised. I really would not be yeah. surprised. Yeah. I. Th you know it. He was able to get a little bit going, especially in that first stock, but mm -hmm. we saw in that second stock just how much Robin can do when he's got all of his projectiles on deck. Right. He's got everything charged up again a lot, a lot, a yep. lot. There she is. On. Yep. Yeah, he needs to neutralize that, so this is Definitely. a good pick. The only and other uh, the only other danger cool. Yeah, that's bad actually. I don't. I don't like Dreamland, mm -hmm. considering that Robin's kill power is generally higher than Rosalina's, assuming Levin's Sword is available. Off the top, at least. Right. See, neutralizes most projectiles, but Dane's bomb just has to be very careful to ensure that he's not throwing out gravitational pulls to the point where he's getting baited to do it. Right. Because that's also a very dangerous position to be in. That move, though, it doesn't have as much uh, cooldown time as it looks like it should. No, not even. No, no. It's it's a beautiful, beautiful move. Oh, goes for a Nosferatu. Tries to go for a reboot, but doesn't get it. Yeah, Dane's mom getting some good pressure on him. Here. Right. And yeah, you can see just how much uh, harder Scorpio has to work to, to put Ooh. damage on right. when the projectiles are neutralized. Oh, I don't think he has the weapon sword. No, he doesn't help. Yep, that was a good wait. Right. Yeah, if, uh... Ooh. Wow. Not quite yet. If, uh... That 11 sword pack. If a Robin can manage to arc fire onto Rosalina's shield, she's kind of stuck. Oh, wow. Too quick for him. That killed. I, I didn't think it would. Yeah, Not there's yet. that low ceiling coming into play, like you are saying. Definitely. That's why, personally speaking, if it's if I'm Rosalina and I'm fighting against another character that kills off the top easily, this is not a stage I would counter. Yeah, no, that, that makes a lot of sense. Maybe battlefield instead. Definitely. 
to see, though. He's going to need to wait out the sumo, but then he'll be very close to the percent. Yep. Wow. Just went way too good. Yeah, that's the thing uh, Dane's mom and I have had a chat about, actually. Uh, aiming launch start can be really tricky. Like, he... Um, I'm working on learning how to be reverse it like he did there because sure. there's four different trajectories for it. Wow. But um, the only problem is he pers like he has a lot of pro of trouble trying to do the the variation where you go straight up, which gives you like the ah. most distance. Okay. And that's what he that was what he needed there. Yep. He probably would have come back if he had been able to do that, but given that he was just that's so pretty far amazing. Down. He's pretty much off the screen. Right. He's sticking with this pick, which is good. I like it. He just has to keep that or, in mind. Or or is he not? Oh. Ah. No contest. Okay, no contest. Cool, I guess. Good set, everybody. We can go home now, everyone. <laughs> it's over. Oh, they got their controllers switched up. Whoops. That'll do it, definitely. All right, now to the proper game three of Winter Semis. Three, two. One, go! Luma just eating that arc fire. Right. This is a matchup where I don't... I don't fight with Luma away from me to begin with, but this is a matchup where I would actually very strongly advise against it. Just oh, because yeah. if you so if many you, tools. Yep, if you leave him out on his own, then Robin gets the space that he wants, and he gets to kill, he gets to kill Luma whenever he wants. Yep. Yeah, and that was really quick. So, just over 20 seconds to get Luma out of there. Right. Yeah, now oh. there's not a... Yeah. That should have hit. That's weird. I'll never understand this game. <laughs> oh, it could be Smash 2. Oh, it could be Smash 2. That's correct. Oof. That's the thing about being that up air. Yep. That's the thing about being above or to the side of Robin in the air. It's it's so scary. Yep. Just look at Levin's sword. Too powerful. Forty seven percent combo from zero. Oh Ooh. strong work off stage though. Oh, and he just misses the ledge snap. That's really that 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 looks so good for about a second. That I don't understand why that didn't work. Yeah. Quick 3-0, though. That's actually really dumb, and I'm kind of mad about that. So are, are we going to have a Peterson uh, Bros matchup in winners?